everybody, and welcome to a new tutorial series on some cool world edit stuff. Um, to start this out, we are going to be talking about FAR building today. But before I start, I just want to quickly mention that most of the things I'm going to be teaching in these series were actually taught to me by my good man, Arcanax. So if I'm saying your name wrong, I am very sorry. Uh, I really don't mean to. <laughs> so. This is his name. Um, if you want to look him up, I will leave a link to his Twitter on in the description. He is an awesome developer. If you have any ideas for him, shoot them to him because he knows how to get it done. Um, anyway, without further ado, let's go ahead and get into the tutorial. So today, we are going to be talking about FAR building. So there are a couple of quick things that I have to mention before we get into the command and stuff. Um, if you have a large area selected, go ahead and stand still and do slash slash post one and post two where you're standing because otherwise some funky stuff's gonna happen if you want to test that out go ahead um, you'll see what I mean try selecting where you're building and uh, some weird stuff starts happening anyway just go out to a, a nice spot and select stand still and do post one post two anyway with that said that'll make it uh, easier for all of the command the next command to work in a good way. <laughs> um, so, without further ado, the command is super simple. It's just lr build, one word, and then you have two numbers. First number is the number is the block you'll be placing with your left click. The second number is the block you'll be placing with your right click. So now, right now I have stone and air. So left click will be stone and my right click will be air. So if I go ahead and press enter, now I'm going to left click, and look at that, I'm building blocks. So, something that is important to note about this uh, command is that if you put, or the block you put on your left click, you have to continuously click in order to place it. You cannot click and hold. However, the block you place on your right, which is air in this case, if you click and hold, you can continuously delete or place blocks. Um, so if I were to switch these around and I were to put air first and then stone, I would be able to continuously place stone by clicking and holding and then I would have to continuously click in order to delete the air. I can't click and hold. So now that you know all that stuff, uh, I hope this all helps you. This is meant to be a pretty short video. I'm just going to go over one thing at a time and hopefully you guys uh, understand what I'm talking about. If you're having any troubles with this command or it's not working, let me know. I'll try to help you out the best I can. Um, other than that, I hope you guys enjoy this series. Uh, see ya!